They say all good things come in threes and the AFC Champions League final is no different when it comes to Saudi Arabia's Al-Hilal and Japan's Urawa Red Diamonds. It was the Reds who lifted the trophy when the two met in 2017 before the Blues got their revenge two years later. Who would have the last laugh as they battle to become the first team to lift the trophy on three occasions? Well, it was Al-Hilal who got off to the better start. Salem al Sari picking up the pieces at the back post the Urawa defense unable to deal with the danger and Aldo Sari was more than happy to oblige an open net and he was there to find it one nothing up after what was a quiet start to the game Al Hilal in blue finding the breakthrough Urawa nearly finding a way through the middle of the Al Hilal defense in the 18th minute a decent ball from Koizumi Shinzo Kuroki stopped in his tracks just before the half-time whistle then it was Al-Hilal on the attack again Mohamed Kano with a shot from distance leaning back slightly and unable to keep it down 1-0 the score at the break in Riyadh and into the second half we go Rawa on the move here a little bit of a, a mishap there and a chance here for the equaliser and it's Shinzo Kuroki taking advantage of absolute mayhem at the back it was fortunate for the Japanese side Albulahi playing the ball onto his own post in an attempt to intercept the ball Almayuf unable to recover and Shinzo Kuroki levelling things up at a one apiece Al Hilal then Desperate to get their noses back in front. The Brazilian Michael with a header from an acute angle. Simple save in the end though for Nishikawa. Not so simple though. Moments later, Musa Marega with an absolute bullet looking for the bottom corner. And Nishikawa with a fingertip save to keep things level. And Aldo Sari. It started well the night in Riyadh for the Al Hilal goal scorer, but it didn't end well. A straight red card for lashing out after being brought down. Silly, really, and he will miss the second leg. 1 1, the final score in Riyadh. Everything is still to play for in the second leg when these two giants of Asian football meet again in Saitama in seven days.